focus there we go hi guys it's olivia welcome back to another video so today i'm going to be showing you guys what is on my brand new iphone 11 pro i'm so excited about this oh my god okay so most of you probably know because i've talked about it on this channel before i used to have an iphone x and that's what i've had for the past two and a half years i think anyway so i was importing photos into my computer like all the photos in my camera roll my phone literally crashed it would not turn on so i had to get a new one one and here we are with my new one so that's the story of that i lost everything on my old phone except for my photos because they had already finished importing but everything else basically was gone so i had to start from scratch on this phone so i would say it was a time but i'm proud of the way that this phone has turned out my phone kind of has like a pink aesthetic going on it has this pink case on the outside i forget what the brand is i'm sorry it's like this pink fluorescent case the actual phone itself is like silver and black it has the three camera right here i'm gonna like sit a little bit to the side while i film just so you guys can see it but i'm going to start screen recording okay so this is what you see when you open up my phone it's just this like pink background fluffy thing goes with the pink aesthetic a little bit and there are all of my apps in all of the folders all organized which literally took me forever okay so i'm just gonna go by folder here kind of okay so if i go into the first folder it's the stars and basically this is my social media folder so the first app i have is tiktok yeah so that's my tiktok my personal tiktok is at olivia platt 05 and then my store tiktok is at designed.by.live so follow both of those accounts um i'm literally obsessed with tiktok the next app that i'm gonna show you guys is my snapchat so say hi to the camera camera snapchat here is my snapchat account i'm like my private story these are all my friends so my next app after snapchat is instagram of course make sure to follow us on instagram at kira.n.olivia the next app is visco i love visco so much let me show you guys my feed so this is my visco you follow people on visco right it's not like adding okay yeah you follow people you follow people on visco like that's right right okay i don't have that many visco followers so i don't really know this is my visco it's olivia platt dash 05 these are all my pictures love my visco i think the feed turned out pretty cool you can like scroll down and find even more pictures so after visco we have pinterest and i really don't use pinterest that much when i use pinterest i kind of just look at other people's pins and other people's feeds and whatever i like made two pin walls is that what it's called a pin wall i don't know what it's called a board oh a pin board oh that's what it's called okay and then we have yolo my favorite app of course no definitely not my favorite app um yeah people say really mean stuff on yolo so like zero out of ten don't recommend people are rude on yolo yeah anyway then we have wink wink is a fun app if you know what i mean okay so then we have my butterfly folder and it has like three blue butterflies on it in this folder is like my communications app so like i have my messages and then we have like facetime then we have the phone app itself then we have whatsapp so i have a lot of friends that live like all around the world i live in the united states but i have friends that live everywhere and whatsapp is one of the easiest ways to talk to them and then i have zoom yay love zoom i have like my singing lessons and other stuff then we have my contact after contacts we have group me so in group me i have like all of my big chats i think messages has like a 32 person limit or whatever but in group me it's like no limit so you can put however many people you want so i have like my grade group chat on group me and we have my gmail no one really cares about that and then we go into the next Next folder which is my teddy bear folder and this folder is for music and other music related stuff so I have like the music app I don't want Apple music no um, 
<laughs> like I don't even really use the music app at all. I have a few songs on here, but I really just don't use the music app. I think this is probably my favorite app on my phone. Like, yeah, this has to be. My pride and joy is my Spotify. I love my Spotify so much. Like I'm obsessed with my Spotify. These are all my playlists. I'm so obsessed with Spotify that I figured out how to get songs from YouTube, songs from everywhere, all into my Spotify. So I listen to them through Spotify now. Like this is my summer remixes playlist. Go follow me, like my playlist. They're pretty good, I think. Like my summer vibes drive playlist is really good. I worked on it with Kira and with Marissa and with Sarka, who you guys have met through this channel. Love them. Then I have SoundCloud, which I literally never use. Then I have SoundTouch, which is basically my music app but it's for my speaker which is back there and then I go into my next folder which is my alien folder this folder is meant for like games and other weird quirky apps so like I have my bitmoji which here's my bitmoji these are all my little bitmoji thingies and then we have holio oh my god I lost all my progress because I had to re-download the app obviously but like this was all I played in freshman year. Psych, I love to play Psych with my friends. Um, then I have Slither IO, and I was also obsessed with Slither IO in middle school, and that's why I have it downloaded. And then we have Flippy Race, and Kira mentioned this in her iPhone video, but we were all obsessed with Flippy Race. Like, we did not stop playing it in ninth grade. And then we have Giphy, which I use for like gifts and funny stuff to send to my friends. And then we go into the White Heart folder, and basically, this is all my school stuff so it's really boring so I'll just run through it quick but we have Docs, we have Quizlet, we have Calculator, Kahoot, Google Classroom, Google Drive, and Google Meet. Quizlet has literally saved me in school. I have used Quizlet religiously to study for certain things. And then we go into my Blackheart folder, which is like my utilities. Is that, that's what it would normally be called on this phone, but it's just clock, compass, voice memos, measure, stocks, Apple TV, wallet, calendar, news pretty boring but yeah and then we start to get into the good folders so this is one of the really good folders that I made and this is like my camera flash folder so I have the camera app obviously photos app and then prequel and I love prequel so much you have no idea I'll show you what it is isn't that so cool my next app in this camera flashy folder is Lightroom and if you guys know I love Lightroom but one of the most sad things that happened happened when I got my new phone was that all of my Lightroom presets were gone. So I was really upset about that, but I did redo, well, I have the settings saved to my Google Docs, so I know exactly what it is, but like I have my beachy preset saved in Lightroom. So the next app in this folder is Pixar. Pixar is pretty self-explanatory. Uh, you can like make fun stuff in Pixar. And I'm actually sad because I lost all my stickers in Pixar. So I had to re-download the app, but you know what? It's okay. Okay, we get through it. Kira and I use Pixart, Fonto, Facetune, Background Eraser, Lightroom, all of those apps to edit our thumbnails. So Fonto is my next app and I can just show you a few of my projects. This is some stuff that I was working on for my business. If you don't know, I have a business. You can watch that video on this channel as well. You can basically type out different things, make different things, that sort of thing. Then we have Facetune. Okay, so if I just take a photo, on Facetune and yeah so I think that that's about right um, I'm pretty happy with the result obviously yeah next App. So now we have background eraser. You can just target an area to erase and there you go. And now it creates a PNG file for you, which if you don't know what a PNG is, basically it's just your image on a clear background so you can upload it, use it for different things. Then we have pic collage and I don't really use pic collage anymore. Filto, kind of unimportant. I never really use it. Clips, also it comes with the phone, but I never really use it. Hyperlapse, I downloaded because I wanted to take like a hyperlapse of the sunset and then it never really worked out very well. Next thing is the panda folder and this is literally the folder that matters the absolute least on my phone. But we have the health app which comes on the phone and then the Fitbit app which I used to wear my Fitbit all the time but I never really do anymore. And the next folder we have is my little dancing dude folder. Then in this folder it is entertainment apps. So we have Netflix which I love Netflix. 
I think everyone loves Netflix though. My favorite show on Netflix as of right now is The Outer Banks, guys. Okay, this is like a major debate, like John B or JJ, but like John B, okay? So if you're watching this video right now, if you watched up to this point, I want you to comment Outer Banks and I want you to comment John B. I need to know other people agree with me. And then the next app we have is Disney Plus and I love Disney Plus too so much. I don't think I could pick between Netflix and Disney Plus. Um, but my favorite things on Disney Plus are High School Musical, the musical, the series, obviously. And then my other favorite thing on Disney Plus that has come out has been Hamilton because I was obsessed with Hamilton in middle school and I still love Hamilton to this day. So I love watching it on Disney Plus. The next app I have is Lifetime. And the only reason I have Lifetime is literally to watch Dance Moms. And I'm sure other people can relate to that. So the next folder I have on my phone is my cloud folder. And basically this is my travel folder. So I have my American Air Airlines app, United, Fly Delta, GoGo -Go Entertainment, Move It, and Disney World Move It. I live near a big city, so we use that to like take the trains and stuff. So the next folder I have is my Red Heart folder, and this folder is literally dedicated to YouTube. So I have YouTube Studio, so it's all of Kira and our analytics, and then I have YouTube itself. Subscribe to our channel. That's basically the whole point of this video. Sub count, it shows us our sub count. Thank you guys so much for always subscribing and supporting us. TubeBuddy, to be honest, don't really use it that much, but it's supposed to show you like more analytics and stuff and help you with tags. YouTube tracker, same thing, really don't use it. And then my next folder, which is one of my other favorite folders, is my pink bow folder, which is my shopping. I have Poshmark, Depop, but Depop is one of my favorite, favorite apps. Custom ink where you can like make t-shirts and stuff. H&M, Forever 21, Misguided, Romway, Shein, Princess Polly, Target, and Amazon. This is my food app folder. So I have DoorDash and oh my gosh, I love DoorDash so much. Okay, then we have Starbucks, which I honestly barely ever use the Starbucks app, but if I go out with my friends or something, like I might need it from time to time. I think I've ended up using it like twice or something. Then we have Uber Eats. That also I never use, but it is an alternative to DoorDash, so if something ever happens to it, I guess I have Uber Eats. But DoorDash is my go-to app. And then we have my Lightning Bolt folder, and this folder is like my money slash finance folder. I have my Venmo, PayPal, and then Shopify. Shopify is what I use for my business, designed by Liv. Go watch the video, go follow it. Right now I have 13 orders, so that's why it has the little 13 notification there. And then my next folder is my little water droplet folder, and this is like my other app that comes with the phone folder, I guess. It's the weather app, the maps app, and the find my iPhone app. My very last folder, which is really boring, <laughs> is the rainbow folder. And basically I just grouped all the apps that come with my phone into this folder that I don't really use. So yeah, the app store, whatever. And then on the bottom bar here, I have the Safari, the notes, mail, and settings. So that is everything on my iPhone. I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. It was super fun to make. Follow us on Instagram at kira.ann.olivia. That's our main Instagram for our channel. So yeah, that is everything. I really hope all of you guys are doing well. Bye guys. Love you. you think you know them, but oh, they want